the Honorable Member for Strathmore Brooks with a private member statement, followed by Grand Prairie Smokey. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. I rise today to recognize the Newell Foundation for their hard work in developing a strategy to address the serious need for aging and care spaces and developing a comprehensive continuing care framework. In 2010, it was identified that there were 975 individuals waiting for placement in the community. This project will ensure that the Bazano Health Centre and its service region, which is three times larger than the town, are properly cared for. The Bazano Continuing Care Centre is intent is to integrate independent living, supportive living, long-term care, primary care and acute care into a fully functional design that supports a variety of community amenities. The integration of these resources will enhance the financial and building design efficiencies. This model will set the stage as a best practice demonstration project for future rural facilities. For the less intensive dedicated care areas such as resident rooms, health care could be overlaid in a home environment with AHS providing health services where the resident lives within the facility as much as possible. The health staff will be funded and employed by AHS but have the ability to flex the location of care as needed and as appropriate within the facility. Designed around a cross-generational model, the centre offers a complete continuum of care and wellness for both young and old. With the land transfer from the town to the foundation now being finalized, the only step left before breaking ground is to sign a service contract with AHS. I trust the Minister shares my gratitude for everyone involved and see how local decision-making can provide the services communities need. I am hopeful that the Minister will ensure that AHS makes this project a priority so that seniors across Alberta get the quality health care services they deserve. Thank you. The